It says some char- it says characters should be looking for us. Well, we know that one character is looking for us, so... Yeah, well, maybe we'll come across them. Hi there, folks, I'm Zerfall. I'm SirSirG. And we just beat up Fuji? Fu- Fuma, Fuma Koji. Yes, and nice. his trust went up, but it didn't pay off. He just doesn't want us to hurt him again. Yeah, he, he trusts us more, but not enough to actually join us. Yeah, so... We used to medicine, too, so we're one medicine in the hole. Yeah. North and a tad east from here is where we're trying to go. So we're going to head pretty much north and look for a mountain. Which is where we were going when we encountered the uh, voodoo guys, the voodoo childs. And these bushwhackers are nothing. Bushwhacker Luke and Bushwhacker Butch. Swinging their arms around, being weirdos. Yeah, you want some of this, bud? About eight points still, bitch. So if it wasn't for the passage of time, we could easily run around out here and fight a bunch of bushwhackers. Whack them right in the bush. So how do we? I want to see what. Oh, this might be it right here. A, this might be it. How concerned should we be about uh, the time? That's. Well, do we know what time it is? It is July thirtieth. And. Uh, Please don't disturb me. I'm in deep thought. I have a flow of time. Oh, maybe we should be checking the tea houses too, actually. This country has a general named Wada Akitama. Let's see. Oh, there's no oh, nothing there. Nothing up my sleeve. Roar. Oh, I guess I need another hat. The dungeon is full of poisonous creatures. You'd better stock up on an antidote. Thanks for the hot tip. That is handy. All right, let's save here. I guess we'll save over the level seven, Mister Zerf. Is there anyone here to meet? Ooh, Amaji Ag Koji came here. We Hanzo talked to this is like guy. The ultimate ninja ever. Oh, we need more trust. All right, let's. Uh, who else is here? Hanzo. Oh man, this guy likes us. Our abilities are quite different. Quite different. I think he's Perfect. Like higher level than we are. Yeah, but it would be a great different different abilities for different uh, jobs. You know, we might as well work together. Let's view him. Whoops. Yeah, he's level 13. Perhaps. And he's an Egan He should be all over helping us get revenge. Yeah. I think eventually he probably will join us, but... Well, if you insist. I didn't mean to talk to him. I meant to ask him. I wanted to talk to the other guy that might actually join our party. Oh, somebody died. Somebody was captured. Oh, Nobunaga's taking over. Yeah, he's taking over. Oh, Bungo! Otasorin died in battle. Jeez, all kinds of crap's going on. Ah, oh, some people are canceling their attacks. Hey, Masamune Date is doing his thing. I'm trying to figure out what year the game ends in. The uh, the FAQ you have will tell you you better win in time, but we're not telling you when that is. It's uh, January first, sixteen oh one. This guy's level seven. Will you enlist? More trust. There's and this Jeff, right? this particular fact suggests that you're not likely to hit that date. Because he basically says the game also ends automatically if you don't win by 1601. If anyone has ever seen this condition, I would love to hear about it. So. Oh man, I, I, when we get towards the end of the game, we might want to just fast forward and find out how it works. Yeah, safe state and um, then intentionally lose lots of time. So there's other people to meet. Uh... Man, this guy. I'm trying to, to power level my trust with this guy here and see if... I mean, I've only talked to him. Oh, he left like a freaking 
He's another one of these guys. And he wants more trust too. Go and tell him I'll listen. But I won't trust you. Oh wow, we got like six talk for six trust for just talking to him. Yeah, but then I should have been talking to this guy the whole time. How have you been, Mr. Zerf? See, he's talking to us all... Uh, yeah, he's all friendly. Kind of like your list. More trust. Later, later, I'm busy. Or are you? Sometimes if you talk twice, they still are like, okay, well. I really need to talk to you. Come on, you ass face. <laughs> Let me talk to you. Listen, ass face, you should trust me. Hmm. <laughs> you should trust me. Because I'm telling you like it is. You have a face like an ass. <laughs> well, <laughs> you must be a truth talker. I trust you more now. So I wonder what and level so we have to... And the Ninja Mr. Zerf spent two months talking to this one guy. Oh, man, just... Just talk to me, bro. Come at me, bro. He's not leaving. Yeah. But he just doesn't trust. I mean, we just saved, so if this doesn't work out at all, we can always just retroactively not talk what's to his, him. Let's view him. What's his deal? He's a hermit. He's a hermit, so... level 7. He's got a bunch of energy. He probably has the heal spell. Later, later, I'm busy. Alright, well, can you talk to me while I use my face as, as an ass? Because <laughs> I'm very busy <laughs> doing that right now. Just not compatible. I'm just gonna talk to him one last time. If this doesn't work, we're just gonna load our game. Oh! This slay has to get a reward. Nice try, buddy. It's a different person who's gonna slay us. He's <laughs> I'm off balance. balance. Nuke him with flame. Check out this move. Flamio Hotman. <laughs> he ran away. Oh, bitch. He wasted uh, a bunch of magic. And made us leave the lodge. What do you want with me? Ask. About Oda Nobunaga. He's yes. natural to obey Nobunaga. He's got a commanding voice. There's Deserve, right? Yep. Who else is here? And you know, great, great to see, see you. you. That's so, so amazing. You. They're just not compatible. Okay, so this guy was a complete waste of our time, apparently. Well, what's his name? I want to Google him, see if he, he can even join us at all. His name is Hanyo. 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 And we also have Otuano now. Hey, this guy was like, okay, let's join up. Oh, nice. So we have somebody else, but what's what do they look like here? They're level 7. They're the same type of ninjas as us, I think. Let's see. Magic. Oh, to magic. Oh, he knows repair. Okay. What skills does he have? No special skills. Okay, what about Mr. Zero? What skills do we have? No special skills. Okay, well, that's something. He's so this guy... As a repair skill. I'm not sure that repair lets you actually. Do we need our ma we need to get our magic back? I'm not sure if it lets you use it on other people in the party or just yourself. But uh, so, was... if we beat up that guy we now have 50 trust with, will he join us then? Or oh, I don't know. Maybe I can give it a can try. We, can here. we get it above 50? Oh, probably. I just it just hit 50. So neat. I know. It's great. It's only going up by two at a time now, though. I just keep saying we're not compatible. Just not compatible. <laughs> I went up by four that time. Yeah. Beat him up. <laughs> I'll show you. There's no reason to fight you, so he's not accepting our challenge because we're already good friends. Okay. Let's ask him info. See, meeting people, compatibility classes. So I'm going to read the fact while we're playing, so let's see. 
Don't you remember me? <laughs> I'm Anyo the Hermit. I know much of these woods. No, oh, let's just let's just lodge here. Twenty gold. Back in my hometown, it was only ten gold for a night. So this is probably where we're going. Oh, our antidotes. if you get your if you get trust up to sixty, I think they will always join you. Okay, well we're pretty darn close for that guy, I guess. I'm just gonna buy some antidotes while we're here. Oh, and different people carry different items. It's one of those games. Mm. So I'm gonna give each of our characters three antidotes. And that should. Zerf is carrying. Mr. Zerf is carrying the uh, medicine. More, more, more. So he might be the only one without a cure spell, but he also will be the one that can heal himself with items. All right, let's meet Hanyo. We only need four more. Come on, let's do it, bud. Talk with me, bro. I, I think he will automatically join us if we reach level 60, but... Okay, let's join up. There we go. We got yeah. him on our team. And new people showed up. This guy's a monk. Ooh, a monk. Oh, man. This level is me. He's, like, afraid of touching things because he's going to get germs, but he's actually a great detective. <laughs> you can't do that. You can't even ask him to enlist. Oh, we already have three people. Perhaps three is the maximum for now. I think it might be. So let's... Let's check our yeah, lab here, though. It sure, certainly looks like it's meant for... Uh... So Mr. Zerf will go here. Tuano put here. And then Hanyo will put here. Does that make sense? Sure. I mean, he's the healer, but... Well, I don't know what his ranged attack is, but... I mean, we should check people's equipment, too, I guess. Headgear. He has a steel helm. Maybe we should just give them all none and take their items. Maybe we should just hire them and then kick them out. This guy's got a helmet, got a helmet, sage robe, gold staff. Actually, I'm not able to give them any of the items. Oh, uh, we shouldn't have sold our projectiles then. Oh, but you're not able to give them items anyway? I don't know. Here we go, give. So, like... If you gave him a... Uh, oh, I can only give him any dotes. I can't give him... Transfer witch. Weird. I wouldn't be surprised. Well, that's so odd. Because I definitely have an yeah, extra like weapon here. Yeah, yeah. Mace. So, what happens if you try to give them a mace? It doesn't let me try. Let's try to items. Items. Give. give. And like I tried to give. Transfer okay. whose item? Go to Mr. Zerf. Ah, Mr. Zerf. You Transfer have the items. Which mace. mace. And give it to somebody else. I think Hanyo might be the only one that might be stronger on. Alright, so let's see. Can we make him equip things now? Everyone's learning about the game's engine together. It's very exciting. Get some helmet. So we probably could equip nothing on him. Yeah, the mace is worse. So I guess people have what they're going to have. I guess what we could do... Do you know what, though? The other guys are weaker anyways. They need the stronger headset. Let's talk to old man. Old year. Welcome, Mr. Zerf. Your ninjutsu is rapidly improving. Here you will learn ancient ninja healing techniques. Your task is to find the Earth Gem and bring it to me. Okay. And, uh, good job hiring those people to help you out. This is a large dungeon. I'm necessary to have companions. You can recruit a mendicant to do so. Their skills are very useful. That's what the monk was, but he didn't show up till late. You really need material. Oh, monk. <laughs> Sam, at you, buddy. All you do is stand there with your staff, I guess, wondering. I guess we shouldn't really have hired uh, these guys. We should have hired a mendicant, but oh well. What did that say? I don't know. It said, "Ah, uh, the Earth Dem is Jeep Underground." Beep boop. Beep boop. Let's try and see now. Toxic worms. 
So I guess we'll attack the one that's closest to our guys to start. Wait, did you do that or do they... Are they uh, I'm controlling it. Can't attack from there. What magic do you have? Heal, purge, and guard. So this guy does have... What does guard do? Oh, see? I put this on this guy. Oh, we glow with power! It yeah, failed! I wanted, magic I wanted to see what it did. Well, I guess that really didn't work out for us anyway. Missed no damage. Jeez. Well, we can have him defend, or we can move him into position where we can attack toxic arms. Nope. Apparently it had two hit points left. Oh, this guy has all kinds of magic, actually. So, does repair... Yes, okay, so we can use repair on anybody. So we have two guys that can heal. I guess that's what we we're looking for. We're only allowed to move within our nine regions here, I guess. So these guys don't take much damage, but we... Uh I already leveled up one of our guys. Yeah, let's level one up. A heal two magic was obtained. There you go, see? Nice. We're getting all kinds of good things. But who learned that? Oh, it was him. How come they can learn magic by just existing and we have to find gems? Yeah. They've already found all the gems, they just need to level up. Oh, I see. Can't attack from there, so he should just defend, I guess. We'll team up on the same worm, I suppose. Oh, we're surrounded! Unless these guys start using some kind of like poison power, they don't really seem to be that dangerous, do they? No, but I think that is what the thing is. Is there's a small chance that they're gonna. They're nice enough to ask you. Oh, oh no, there you go. Venom. Is he gonna miss? Oh, it goes on a straight line. Oh, just Mr. Zerf avoided the attack. It goes everywhere. All right, so we had double poisoned already. So, got, we're attack uh, near. We got anna boots, but do we have? Uh, well, yeah, that's what I'm curious is if the heal magic will take care of what we need. Yeah, I got a pretty damn critical hit there. He was pretty pissed off with that thing. Purge, maybe? That's what I meant to pick here. Purge. So, when... So sure. There you go. Yep. And it didn't take very much magic to use, actually. Oh. It worked out pretty good. So well, I suppose we're trick. better off holding our... No, no, because we cast... Uh, the I think he leveled up. He leveled up, though. Oh, it was him that leveled up. For some reason, I thought it was the other guy. So we need to cast it again on him, because he's still all poisoned. Yes, but... Here's the... Yeah, he is still poisoned. Okay. I was wondering if it was one of those games where the poison goes way after the... Magic. Oh, yeah. Yeah, this is not Final Fantasy Mystic Quest, unfortunately. <laughs> His body was purged of the poison. Was so far... This dungeon's pretty linear. Pretty linear. It looks like a poison snake. Is it just like a like I was gonna say? Is this just like a poison worm? Anamora appeared. Attack. Do you know what? I have a feeling we're gonna level up, so I'm gonna use a little bit of magic here because by the time we get down further, I'll get rid of these venom guys. I don't like the guy with venom in his name. Yeah. It seems likely that he's got. Venom powers. He's got venom in his name and he's got venom in his mouth. Venom in his name and venom is his game. I guess we'll never find out now. So I might move him up a little bit yeah, too. Yeah, so that we can actually use everybody. Yeah. Because he doesn't have the worst defense. Giant Serpent's Toast. Hey, we got an antidote. Good thing those poisonous snakes were carrying around an antidote in case of accidents. 
Yeah. They accidentally poison each other. Alright, so let's real quick change our formation up. Line up. So, what do you think is best here? Mr. Zerf up forward and then the other two guys sort of in the wings like this? So they're not yeah. blocking each other? Or do we want to try to get it so that we surround a guy as he moves up? Yeah, we can put all three of them in the front row. I don't see why we can't have six people. There's six spots. Oh, you're gonna get beat down. Yeah, we got an antidote. Yeah, and someone other than Mr. Zerf seized it. Mr. Zerf's like, hey, I killed it. He's like, yeah, well, I seized the antidote. You should have been grabbing antidotes. I suppose I might as well move up here, yeah. For off balance. It seems like it's pretty hard to get a worm off balance, too, because. Missed no damage. Now we have no idea what type of attacker you are. Whoops. <laughs> I forgot that it moves you down to move if you already did move. Like, it remembers each person's position. It's one of those styles. One damage. Yeah, I don't think he's going to be a best attacker right now. Oh, no. Well, at least the other two avoided the attack. We've been picking up antidotes, so we might want to just... Yeah, we'll antidotes. just grab one for now. I mean, he can't get there in time, so why doesn't he just use the one that he grabbed? Oh man, blue flames of antidote. Purge we the poison. Use poison before the battle is over again. His boo! Okay, but to be fair, it didn't hit Mr. Zerf, so we're still technically... Oh, I guess I have the guy use uh, perks magic this time. I don't know how many... How many uh, antidotes we can count on. You know. We have found two so far. Yeah. Beep oh, boop. Barely take a stack here. Well, we'll have some pretty serious. Like, you should. No, why are we. Well, I mean. Because there's off three. <laughs> gotcha. In our off screen adventuring that you can do uh, however long it takes before we stop leveling up, uh, you should be able to get some. Hopefully, you'll be able to level up everybody up a little bit with this place. It's a very, very linear dungeon. It's like yep. We'll level them up, and then we'll also sell a bunch of antidotes once we're done with poison. I was just curious if there was a secret wall there or something. I don't think this is the type of game to have a secret wall. Ah, but now we have now Trixie Paths. Oh, two different Venomoras. Well, he did two damage to it, so that's a little better. I think we I definitely just need to get that guy. Team up yeah. on the one that is uh, fighting a healer guy, and not the other ninja should be able to handle himself a little bit better. Yep. I just wish their venom attacks weren't just like AOE every time. Like it seems a little. Yeah, that's a bit much. You gotta stop uh, moving when you're not trying to move. Yep. Here's the here's a good plan though. What if we back him off? This thing come to us. I guess that didn't work, but oh, so, oh, it tells you when it's almost dead. Oh, it gets a red name. They might poison us again. But they might not. We're getting a lot of experience points. I'm thinking we're going to level up pretty soon. Yeah, uh, why did you heal him up instead of just finishing the fight? Because he got poisoned again. Well, he what, the, the healer's not going to finish the fight. He's going to go over there and do one damage and not kill it. Well, no, but I mean, he could have defended. Like, 
Yeah, I felt like you're wasting magic points. Not that big of a deal. Somebody is leveled up. I don't think. I think it's our ninja friend. Yes, I feel Forge that magic, magic points. Thing. Magic points are there to be used, not to be hoarded until you level up and then wasted all of them. <laughs> you say that even though you just got done healing some. Like you, you, were, you removed poison for four seconds. <laughs> medicine. This is medicine. Because I meant to use a. I don't use the medicine by mistake. Listen, you are too concerned with the things in this game. These things are inexpensive, That's and true. magic points and are... And are really cheap. And magic points are easy to come by. You gotta choose the level up. So they stop letting you level up. Yes. And then, so and then you can't get in a fight. For, for all time now, or we just, like these are loyal friends forever? Because if so, we should probably remember their names and assign them voices and personalities. <laughs> Ojo Wano. Ojo Wano Cracker. See, he needs like one fight left to get all his magic points back. Okay, that's a loop. Is the stress level for us still high? I mean, is it slipping as time passes? <laughs> I don't know. Check. I'm curious now. I think they can beat your party. Uh, I mean, if this menu feels like you should be able to have more people. This is not really telling us. Yeah. You can probably meet them when you're in the end. Or maybe not, though. Well, here's a treasure. Body healers inside. Uh, body healer machine, machine, go. <laughs> I'm kind of disappointed actually in our 8 point star. It seems like it's we're still better off moving in to close this stuff and killing it. I really wanted it to like, be a thing of the past to. Uh, this is like our ideal fight. There's a stronger one at the top for us to take on, and yeah, and he can practice a little pokey stick action on the. But we definitely need to get him a uh, ranged weapon. Same with the, the bottom guy. Because eventually Han Yao could just be like poking stuff with a really long stick. We got an antidote. Okay. So 1601 and Obanaga isn't dead and the game ends. <laughs> <laughs> he's like, oh, he spent, he spent 50 years in a cave. Yeah, some old school enemies there, the centipede. Yep. Who knew they were poisonous the whole time? Oh, wow. oh no, two damage. That's okay, I was off by a couple uh, magic points. Or experience points. So there he is, leveled up. No skills this time. Are we close to the end of the video now? Or? Uh, yeah, we're getting pretty close. We're not. Maybe this place out by the next video. Oh, this guy's getting in a world of hurt. I got poisoned. I wouldn't know. Oh, there's oh. a way down. Yeah. But there's another way that way that we never went. I can explore that then. Off the screen, if anything cool happens. Well, we might have to like go down a level and then back up a level somewhere. Oh man, there's CBC logos. Who knows what they do? SCTV is on the air. Oh, come on. Two people? Really? Oh, 
only you to poke him with the stick a little bit harder. Mm-hmm. Well, purge, purge, purge. Yep. Purge is the word. Well, I guess next time we're going to be finishing up this dungeon. Now that it's a crazy split path going every direction, it might take us a little longer. And we're going to binge on snake meat and then purge the poison from our bodies. So? But, you know, purging is fun. You should always purge. <laughs> I'm Zerfall. I'm Sirius JG. And we'll see you folks next time.